Yes, apparently we are running. Hello everybody, my name is Kai, otherwise known as Bambo, and this is part three of Seven Mysteries. Now we are stuck in the library currently at the minute, so door's like oh you kinda of presume the door was locked. I've got this book, and uh That's what happens when I look at the notebook, so I can't don't really know what to do. Am I supposed to sit down? Am I supposed to go to the Okay. I thought that was a little bit of a bug problem. Just sit there. I think I shouldn't read it anymore. Where am I supposed to be? I'm supposed to read over here. Ah, there we go. Progress. Progress. Hmm. The writing is bad. It's so hard to read. But there's something inside it. A map? Game. Back door, library music. One. A treasure map? The X must be the treasures. Treasures. There are four axes. <laughs> Looks like I've got something fun to do. I'll be killed by the curse anyway. A little game won't hurt. Very defeatist attitude you have, sir. Maybe. I'll find some useful information. So I'll start with the first one. It is in this library. Good. I'll tear this page from the notebook. Take the candle and move it to where it seems suspicious. If something shines into the light of the candle, take it. Open menu item to use the map. Um, okay, looks like we've got a nice little mini games play here. I'm not going to complain, it's something to do. I presume the first one's probably going to be around the corner, bearing in mind it's something that I haven't actually been. Well, I've been here, I just haven't had to do anything. Oop. And a key. Okay, I uh, got a rope and a key. Much logic. Fuck you, game. I presume that was the first one. Hope this key works. Well, hey, success face. All right. Good stuff. Right, okay, let's have a look at this map then. Oh, that's pretty cute. That's pretty cute. Okay, so the next one is in the WC. The bathroom. Is there a save point there? There is no longer a save point there. Fantastic. So I'm just going to go back to the library and I'm going to save it. Okay, I'm not going to go back to the library and save it, because whoever programmed this decided, ha! Fuck you, Kai. Thanks, programmer. Uh, how do I put the map away? It's kind of in the way. Anything in here? Toilet roll. Obviously. Or obviously not. Okay, okay, let's try the other bathroom. Oh, what's this? A calendar. December 2012 with the eye that's bloody. Hmm, I wonder what it means. Good, now it's time for the third treasure. So easy. Oh, he had to say that, didn't he? Uh, you've probably got us. Killed. Just a broken bulb. Yeah, because bulbs just break like that. Okay. I saw that coming. Oh, shut up now. What is that? Day blah, 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 13. First period, class lacks energy. Second period, long disrespecting the teacher. Third period, class lacked voluntary spirit. It's from the teacher's notebook. Who saw and hid it here? The teacher. 
perhaps. Wait a second. According to the map, the fourth treasure is not far. We're right outside the school building. I should find it first to save time. So what does that mean? Going out the back door. Okay, dokey then. I just moved that mouse off the screen. I heard something. There's a bat. I see you, bat. There are many bats. Hole. Anything in the hole? Nope. Or are they crows or ravens? Ah, they're birdies. Okay, okay then. I kind of thought that they were bats. So here, let's run away from the school. No, escape. You complain about being at the curse of the school, yet two people have been given the option of being outside and neither of them decided, you know what? I'm just going to go away. I can hear somebody walking. You can't hide that from me. I can hear it. I can hear that. Is it over here? It's just by the music room, so it's right in this corner. There's something here. No, that's not it. What the f what was that? Focus, I shouldn't be distracted now. You're playing a game of... You're playing a treasure hunt. I think you're allowed to be a little bit distracted right now. The map says the treasure is here. But this... Isn't this an empty field? Strange. Or is it hidden in this room? Let's break the window and go inside. Ah ha! Okay. I get you now. There's a pen behind the window. Yes! There's only one left. The other one, you know, causing all the problems to start off with. You are just the worst kind of person. Can't seem to go from the back there, so I'm just going to go around. Uh, I suppose that would make things far too easy, you know, wouldn't it? Oh, well, we, this, this is the asshole that started it all, put it that way. Uh, there's nothing down those holes where I checked. Looks like the birdies have already scampered. Apart from you, are you going to scamper? Apparently not. Let's go. I can't tell because <laughs> the map's in the way. Alright, so let's go down to the music room. That quite clearly says no. Don't. According to the map, the third treasure is in this room. The music classroom. This is the rope ladder. I think it's the ordinary piano. Third treasure. Is it this piano? Well, was it? It looks normal. Would the treasure appear if I hit a key? Dot, dot, dot. I hear footsteps. Somebody's here. This time? I should hide somewhere.
fuck is going on? Oh. <laughs> what just happened? It's not time to think now. I shake the treasure and return to the library. Looks like a diary. This could be what I was looking for. Now I have all four treasures. Let's go back to the library. Okay. Earlier the girl took the candle I placed on the table. There must be some sort of lighting device in the corpse. Really? Gross. Here it is. A flashlight. I was right. Just casually, you know, just take the stuff from the corpse. Don't, it's, it's, you know, it's your natural instinct. You know, let's just rummage around. The music changed. Watch the music. Nope. Not happening. Nope. That sign says, oh, actually, the floor panel. Nope. Nah. -uh. Can't make me. Music's gone again. Ooh, it's gonna wait for me in here. I'm sure that was the. What's this one? Oh, there's. There's something on the. Save. Save. Just be safe. Don't know right now. Why is the notebook here? That's what I noticed that as I walk up here. I'm like, what the fuck? Let's see. First treasure, the rope. Second treasure, the calendar. Third treasure, the diary. And the last, the pen. What does all this stuff mean? Diary could be the answer. <laughs> Judge Five, good morning. Good morning to you too, sir. Wait, at least we get some sunshine. After long and murky rains, the sun eventually rises, but my cloudy days remain with the school. To me, every day is depressing, and time goes so by so fast. A life without purpose, it's tasteless and boring. Today, a girl and an old man, they came to school. Just one look and everybody knew that they were a pair of wealthy father and daughter. Creek. A new student. Hello, my name is Thay. I'm looking forward to... All right, take your seat at the end of the room. Class, be still. I'm going to check the timetable for next week. It won't take long. Hey, you're not from around here, are you? Yeah, I'm from Hattink City. It's far away from here. Why did you transfer here? Your school wasn't good enough? It's not that. It's because my parents got divorced, so I... December 5th. A new student. It seems like everybody ignored her. December 9th. A student standing atop the school building started leaning down. And she fell. Number 9. It said at the uh, opening screen to uh, take notes of numbers. So that's what I'm doing. Both of her legs broke. Bones punched through the skin. Blood gushed out. I never thought this way of suicide could cause such a horrible death. December 10th. Everybody seemed to forget the whole thing. Within a day, I have the feeling that people around the school are heartless. X, 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 X. X. Today at the library, I found a strange painting. It felt like it was looking at me. X, 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 X. And I found a secret room behind the mirrors. December 11th. It's bad. When I was looking out from the windows of another classroom. <laughs>
A rock crashed through the glass and hit me hard. It was blurry, but I thought I saw her. December 12th. There's my birthday. It looks like they replaced the broken glass. But every time I gave it a glance, I see her blurry shadow. Is she the only one who made my eye like is she the one who made my eye like this? I can't be sure of anything. December 14th. Another student dead. They say he used a pen to pierce through his ears. It was terrifying me. He laughed crazily before he died. Even after he died. 14. Still, just like the first time, everyone kept ignoring it. I don't know if they really ignored whatever happened or they were simply too terrified to talk about it. But in the end, why did this, any of this even happen? I don't think the deaths are coincidental. December 15th. I'm in the secret room I accidentally found out. In here, I found a page from my calendar, a piece of paper with the alphabet written on it, and a pen on the table. So I circled the dates of the deaths. 9, 11, 14. I think everything happened for a reason. <coughs> Ow! By then there was a scream. I ran to the classroom to pen panic to check to see what was happening. Another death? No, not just one. The number increased. Okay. Fifteen. There was a crazy thought in my mind about the reasons for these deaths. Nine, eleven, fourteen, fifteen. I decided to spend the night here in the secret room. At the school, the night passes by in silence. Strange silence. But what's stranger than silence is... The new student, Thai, was standing at the secret room's door. Then she opened the mirror and walked in. Now I can be sure of one thing. All of the misfortunes they started when she came into this. I heard her steps coming closer and closer, but I made it to the closet opposite to the, dusk, to the desk. I often used to write my diary. I was cowering in there with fear and anger. Two emotions blended with each other inside of me. When I woke up, she'd gone. Son of this December 23rd. December 23rd. More deaths. I think she killed them all. Why doesn't anyone else suspect her? Why just me? 9, 11, 14, 15, 23. December 24th, right now I'm at the library. Many students in the other classes have transferred away after seeing the deaths. The school has gotten dark and gloomy. I don't want to be here any longer. I want to get out of here. But then... March 13th, a new semester has started. I don't have the care about that school anymore. It feels so good to be out of that corpse-filled school. But I'm also sad because I won't see him anymore. March 14th. Tonight I'm going back to that school and leave everything involved along with the sins I've committed behind. I don't want to have anything related to that haunted place. Everything I've taken from that secret room, I'll hide them in the different places. Where they'll be never found. Although that's the idea. I still hope someone will discover all of this. Despite the fact that it is very dangerous to be done. For now. And if my wish ever came true, I'll gladly take the consequences. Goodbye, stormy days. Well, that was enthralling. Fair enough. I'm coming up on the 20 minute mark, so I'm going to leave the episode there. But that was episode three of Seven Mysteries. And uh, I think we're on. We'll be on chapter five. Chapter six. I'm not going to bloody clue. Let's just crack on, shall we? Hopefully, I'll see you all in the next episode. Let's see you later. Bye bye.
Fuck you, game. Hello, everybody. My name is Kai, otherwise known as Bambo. And yes, I'm fucking back. Get me. Um, I've been waiting for this game for God knows how long. I've been keeping up to date with it for ages.